Hey babes, what's up? It's Haley, and welcome back to my channel. Who's excited for another thrift trip? Specifically for today's video, we're gonna be continuing my little thrifting different decades series. I actually did an entire video thrifting 2000s trends a little while back. You guys have absolutely loved it, and I thought that for today's video, being that in 2019, I've been noticing so many different trends from the 90s coming back, I thought it would be so fun to take you guys in the thrift store with me and pretty much go ahead and find all those different 90s trends that are dominating our fashion industry right now. I literally compiled an entire list of everything we're gonna be looking for, Throughout the video, I'm gonna be checking off everything that we find, hopefully serving you guys up a lot of different inspo on what to look for if you wanna be that little 90s fashion queen. So without further ado, I have a really good feeling about today and I'm so excited to get into it. So let's head back into the 90s. guys are new to my videos you got to get used to the fact that i always start off in the men's section especially when it comes to denim what i love about the 90s specifically denim in terms of mom jeans overalls jackets and every single form denim is having a moment and especially in 2019 people have just been experimenting so much on styling different pieces of denim so right now here in the men's section we're gonna go ahead and look for some denim jeans resembling these kind of styles and hey i'm not saying look for specific brands but there is something about levi jeans that genuinely fit sort of the best Seriously epic, I just found these incredible overalls. I actually don't own a single pair of overalls, surprisingly. These are almost black, but they're still such a beautiful denim. I don't know the brand, but they are a size 28, which is so freaking rare. Definitely gonna try on these babies because I feel like they're such a 90s staple. Just found an incredible pair of Lee jeans. They are super high-waisted, and I love how baggy and straight the legs are. High-waisted loose-fitting jeans in general is pretty much the definition of a mom jean. These ones specifically are Lee, which Urban Outfitter actually carries. I really love the shade of this denim. I feel like it is a perfect blue, but even though it's a 32, it does look like this one will fit, so let's try it on. All right, so activewear. Literally, I have such a love-hate relationship with this section because on one hand, I love sweaters and hoodies, but on the other hand, it's like I just keep buying more and more that I don't need and they just pile up in my room. But anyway, I feel like we definitely needed to come to this section because in the 90s, there were so many different sweatshirts that people were styling with like little graphics on top. And I actually just found one that represents it perfectly. Calvin Klein was literally like such a huge iconic brand of the 90s. And I definitely feel like this sweatshirt embodies it perfectly. Size medium, it definitely is a little bit faded, has a little bit of pilling. I guess that's why it's a bit cheaper. But I definitely feel like I can picture me styling this in an entire 90s fit. So, you know, I'm adding that one to cart. <laughs> But crewnecks, on the other hand, is definitely something that I've been seeing being styled a lot, especially by like Rachel Green in her entire Friends situation. This is like a perfect great crewneck. That's kind of weird because I do see the Nike symbol, but uh, what? When it comes to actual pants, and I'm not talking denim, like literally regular pants, plaid bottoms was a given, striped ones were also super popular, flowy pants, corduroy, big material as well. So those are just a few of the styles we're gonna be on the lookout for. These actually look like such a good quality, beautiful pair of pants, super, super high waist fit, and I just love that they have these little thin stripes, but they're actually a nice white color. I'm gonna try these ones on. Oh my God, what a find. These pants, Ralph Lauren, black striped pants, so 90s. I'm pretty sure like Monica wore a pair of pants like this in one of the Friends episodes. And guys, it's literally 100% linen. Insane. I'm praying that these fit me because they're so beautiful. Another little pair. I can't tell if these ones will be high-waisted or not, so I will have to try them on. The good thing about pants, especially if you're looking for different patterns, you can just scan the entire aisle, look for patterns that appeal to you or colors that just stand out to you. And that way it's a little bit easier for you guys to find exactly what it is you're looking for. that either everybody was wearing jeans, like literally a stiff mom jean denim, or they were wearing little mini skirts. We could find those like cute, cute, clueless-esque plaid skirts. That would be ideal. And when it comes to skirts, you'll definitely want to be going through every single size because especially a lot of these skirts that come from the 80s and 90s, their sizing was totally way different. So something that could have been a small back then is a large now or vice versa. So be patient, go through every single one of these because I noticed with skirts, those gems are truly hidden in there. I 
like I said, corduroy, really something that makes me so nostalgic because so many of my clothes back then were from corduroy. And this one actually has a pair of shorts under, so that's super comfortable for me. This one is so perfect, almost schoolgirl, but kind of still has that colorway I'm going for. Um, it does look like it may be a bit big on my waist, but I still want to try it on. I'm loving all these like little plaid skirts. What a moment. Just tried on this amazing blazer. I have one side where the sleeve is just down and then one side where I actually rolled it up. Like I said guys, it does have the shoulder pads. Don't let that scare you. You can easily cut them out from the inside. I'm probably just gonna show that in a future thrift flip, but I really love the way that this one fits. Just a large size in the women's section, super popular. I see Aritzia recreating a ton of these right now. And this pinstripe detail is something we've been seeing so much in the 90s. So many different 90s gals were literally the queens of turtlenecks and I'm saying like turtleneck tops, turtleneck t-shirts, turtleneck sweaters, there were so many different options there. And looking for turtlenecks among a multitude of different tops is very simple. All you actually have to do is look at the top of the hook right here. Wherever you see fabric covering it, most of the time it is a turtleneck. You guys know I've just been obsessed with little mini cardigans. I feel like they're so easy to wear, especially if you want to wear a little tank top but you want some sleeves. Throw on a cardigan and automatically it looks like an entire complete outfit. And I just found a super cute one that kind of replicates what I'm wearing right now. So a couple more things I found in the top section. You guys can see I'm obsessed with pink right now. I found this like little lace up guest top. I think it is so cute. It just depends how it's gonna fit. But this little lettuce hem is so 90s. I've been seeing this everywhere on like Brandy Melville tops, Urban Outfitter tops, so cute. And then I found two little pink cardigans. It just depends which one is gonna fit me nicer because this one obviously has a lower neckline than this one does. And now we're actually looking for little tees and tank tops. But a couple things you guys wanna keep in mind, especially if you wanna achieve that 90s look in tank tops, is elements like thin, thin, thin spaghetti straps and or square necklines because those were huge in dresses, especially tank tops. You find some satin and silks, that'll be amazing too. And one more thing, if you guys can score on these like turtleneck vests, um, even better because how Rachel Green is this? <laughs> this little top is super pretty and exactly what I mean when I'm talking about satins and silks. What a beautiful color and just this shiny material. I remember when there was a point where we threw out like all of our clothes in this fabric because we thought it was tacky and now it's back. I feel like this is actually something that can look super cute underneath the overalls that we found. Okay, so I actually have so much stuff to get through. You guys saw how big my card is, so I'm probably gonna do a little quick overview of every little thing that I got. Um, this first one, periwinkle blue. I love the stripe going across. It has a stripe at the bottom too, but I just tucked it in. So cute. Loving little holder dots too. So I actually really like this top a lot, but something I have to know with cable knit tops, they're very, very hard to tuck in. So unless they're already cropped, because they do end up looking a little bit frumpy, so I am gonna pass on this one, even though it's such a beautiful color. I'm like so into this little piece. I don't know if I'd wear it with a tube top, but holy, I love this periwinkle blue. It just fits so cute, and it's literally like another little girly version of a cardigan. Let's just try on a couple of cardigans right now. First, I have this little pink one. Like I said, I really like the ones that come all the way up, because that way, if I just button one button here, I don't have to wear anything under, which is what I love. And then here is another little option. Obviously, this one is a lot more mini, but I think this one I can wear as a full out top as well. 100% cashmere turtleneck sweater. Yes, please, definitely a 90s essential. Mom jean sneakers and a black turtleneck. So easy to style, super comfortable, and a great essential for fall. Especially with like little hoops for accessories, I love it. All right, yes guys, for bottoms, we actually scored the big change room. Here are all the little bottoms that we have to try on. So much plaid, so much corduroy, looking cute. And let's get started. I am actually beyond obsessed, first with this entire look, and second of all, this skirt. If it's so super high-waisted, as you guys can see, and has a little bit of the pleats, has a little bit of the plaid, nothing feels more like a 90s girl than this. This one is also a super nice fit, and I just feel like everything paired with a little black cardigan, it just makes every outfit look so freaking cute and so freaking old school. Hey. Hello! Sarah wasn't feeling her best, so she called me wanting to get some soup, and I said, come thrift with me, you'll feel better. Of course, come to the dustiest place. And she already found something. Look at that. So these Ralph Lauren linen pants, I'm a little sad because I feel like if only they were a size smaller, they would have fit me perfectly because they are a little bit big. They don't fit me as form-fitting as I would have wanted. So I was actually able to tuck in this Calvin Klein sweater into the skirt. I think that this is actually such a cute look, definitely reminiscent of the 90s as well. So these ones, such a cute pair of plaid pants too. Only issue 
to. It's a little bit too loose here on the waist for me because with like a little tank top and a cardigan, it can be such a cute look. If only it was a little bit more high-waisted and form-fitting, then I could have made it work. And okay guys, for the final look, we're going off with the bang because these overalls, I'm actually shocked. I've never found a pair of overalls that fit me so nice. And I'm actually wearing it with that little bandeau. Um, I thought the fact that it had that lettuce hem, definitely a little 90s touch. I have no idea what brand this is, but thank you for making literally the best fitting pair of overalls ever. It has the little belt loop here, and I love that they're not too baggy or too skinny at the bottom. So perfect to just wear with some Nikes. Oh, I love it so much. So Sarah, are you feeling better? Yes. Yes, How thrifting made you me? feel so much better. Like she found so many away. cute goodies. Look at this little mini bag. Oh, it's a Levi's jacket. Adorable. Yeah, I love it. And she found me this awesome little top. I'm not gonna try it on, but I'm just gonna get it. Yay, so successful. I'm good at Okay guys, so I'm actually back at home right now. Um, I was with Sarah, so I got distracted to film an outro. But anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed this entire come through with me. I got so many amazing goodies. Don't know yet what I'm gonna do with these. Maybe I'm gonna film another 90s styling video, or maybe I'll even save it for like a themed video. I know you guys have been requesting me to do like a friend's themed video, so that could be coming up real soon. But thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed it. Be sure to give it a really big thumbs up if you did. Comment down below which trend of the 90s you love the most, which you would style, which piece was your favorite. I think the whole overall look was my fave. Be sure to also follow me on Instagram to see me wear these outfits out and about, and subscribe down below to join the amazing family if you haven't already. Love you all so much, and I can't wait to see you in my next one. Bye.